Alright, let's get to this one. I hope you're having a good day. Doing question number one. Question number one. It or is it not? Looks like. I don't get that it's totally done. In the other person's mind it might be for now. It still has personal struggles going on, so he's going to be hesitant about getting into anything. So is it totally? No, it's not totally. I still don't get that. You even have thoughts. Thoughts about the future. Good thoughts. So not totally, but there is the other party's hesitation in making it happen again. You now it takes some work, but the answer is no, it's not totally over. Career. <clears throat> Question number two. Future in it, current. One more. Well, the job is a job. That's what I'm getting there. Do I see you staying at that job for a long time? No, I don't. I do get you moving on, and it'll be better for you to move on. The job, you'll be getting more and more responsibilities. I don't know about how much how well you're doing pay-wise, but like I said, serving the purpose now. If you're already having thoughts about it, it's okay. I think it's a good time to keep on looking. But at least you're employed and be able to make ends meet somewhat doing what you're doing. I'm going to look. I also want to see is it a good time for you to continue to look while you're employed. Obviously the answer is yes, but is it a good time for you to look? It's still question number two. A little extra. One more. Is it a good time for you to be looking? 
yeah, it's a good time. You might not find anything right away. Don't let anybody know that you're looking, though. Keep on doing the best that you can. Because this job might lead to bigger and better things, but still doesn't mean that you're going to be staying there. That would be your choice. It's not like anyone's wanting to get rid of you. Nothing like that. So again, it shows that you'll probably be moving on when you're ready. Don't give them a reason to get rid of you. His thoughts on you now. Question number three. So we've got good thoughts, we've got conflicting thoughts. And this sort of goes back to question number one, where he thinks it's probably over, but doesn't necessarily show that it's over in his mind. You know, whatever, that's his thoughts, right? But he has other things going on. Not just relationship-wise. So, good thoughts. Thinking still? Yes. Anyone else? Still question number three. Anyone else? As in anyone else in relationship wise. Do I have them in a relationship? Nope. Has he thought about someone from the opposite sex? Yes. Has he tried to make contact with that other person? Yes. Did it work out? No. So you got a yes and no answer on that. Anyone else? Has thought about it. A little action on it work out? No. So, yes and no. That's a little different. Contact. Question number four. Or. Contact or. Could there be contact? Yeah, there could be contact. I got more here on that. He's thought of contacting you several times. He hasn't. I'm actually getting a fall in his maturity rate, so, uh, you know, we get the fool, and this is showing childlike behavior from him. 
towards that question of contact. And I think, you know, yeah, he is showing a little low on that scale today. Contact seems like it might be coming through a third party. So would you have contact from him? Yes, but it might be through someone else. Mail. Through a mail. Anyway, that's your questions. Contact, yes. Thank you for the reading. I'll see you later. Remember, there's... I got a new domain out there also. It's mystic dash charles.com in case you need to get me over on psychicboulevard.com just a mystic dash charles.com will take you there fast or you know how to get me I'm out there thanks